Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame Though it might be nice to own a jet plane I'ma do it all for you, come along Hello there, all of you possum people. My name is Grind Panda. Welcome back to another <laughs> to another surgery video. Now this one was a request from somebody, and um, and this is scoliosis. I have no idea what scoliosis is. It's something to do with your spine. Really, something to do with your spine. <laughs> Whatever. Um, okay, so we're back with this nurse right here again. Okay, uh, let's operate. Okay. Okay, Melissa, she's a patient with scoliosis. This has led to poor posture and she is beginning to experience significant pain. We must operate immediately. We'll have to perform a spinal fusion. This might not have like a timer thing, right? Okay, doctor, we need an x-ray to see inside the patient's chest. Let's get her to the x-ray room. It should be one of these three rooms. This one? Okay. Great work, doctor. Use the button so we can move the camera into position for the x-ray. Put the cross over her belly button and take the x-ray. Okay. The mouse cut out there for a second. Okay, so we can move right here. Or we can, no, we can't use the arrow keys. Good job. This is an image of the spinal column. It's, it definitely has an irregular shape. Oh my gosh. Some people have that? Okay, doctor, we need to move the patient to the operating room. It should be one of these three rooms. It's this one. Okay. Good work, doctor. Now inject the intravenous anesthetic. Please select the syringe from the table, all right? Now select the anesthetic bottle. Okay, very good, doctor. Fill the syringe with enough anesthetic for the procedure. Be sure to pay attention to the marks on the bottle. Okay. Now perform the injection. Oh! Great work, Doctor. We must wait four seconds for it to take effect. Okay, um, I've never had surgery before. Not once in my life. Okay. Now we must sterilize the patient's back. Please select the tongue. So, okay. Select the cotton from the table. Okay. Now hit the patient's back with the cotton. Pick up the marker from the table. Oh no. I already know it's gonna be bad. Now we are ready to make the first incision. Please let the scalpel to begin. Oh my gosh. Alrighty. Ah. Now pick up the retractors from the table. Yep, there's a timer on this. Oh, that looks horrible. Please like to drill to make six holes. Oh, I didn't know bows could. You can drill? Doctors can literally drill into people's bones? That is seriously messed up. Now pick up the rods. Reverse the, uh, the curvature of the spine. This will make it much stronger. Okay. Oh. Now pick up the screws from the table. <laughs> Insert the screws, okay? Now I must use the screwdriver. Please remove from the table, okay? And use it. Okay? I didn't know this could literally happen. How? 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 Oh, it's moving a little bit. Oh. Now pick up the clamps. What am I need the clamps for? Use the clamps to separate the vertebrae. Oh! That's like the tongs. Now remove the part of the invertebrate. Oh, that is messed up. Pick up the inner body infusion case from the table. It contains parts that will merge with the inner... Invertebral disc. This will help Chris. Okay, it's right here. Now remove the clamps. Okay. Now we need to adjust the rods. So the medical wrench. 
just rods, okay? Okay, now move the retractors. Now select the needle and thread, okay. I've done a fabulous job, Doctor. I'm sure the patient will recover in no time. Good. Cool. Um. I now have a desire to turn uh, to do a knee surgery. I think we're gonna do a knee surgery. Okay, this should be the knee surgery. All right. We're back. So let's get into it. A new logo. at the right side of the meniscus <laughs> this is going to require an operation let's get Steve to the operating room and prep for the surgery the room should be behind one of these doors this one okay first we need uh, we need to clean any hair from the table please grab a chair and clean from the table okay now come in with okay so it's doing it for me Good. Now pick up the razor. Don't mind that beeping sound you just heard. That was probably that was my cousin's iPad. <laughs> ah, what the heck is wrong with me? All right. Now you can apply the antiseptic solution. Okay. Now please pick up the tongs. Okay. The cotton ball, and we gotta dip this thing in there. And boom. That's right, now uh, now the area is clean, we can inject an anesthetic to numb Steve's knee. Okay, we're gonna need an anesthetic, now inject in Steve's knee. Now we'll wait a moment for the anesthetic to start working. It work. We will now make the first incision. We select the scalpel. Oh, it's just a little cut. Good work, now please pick up the cannula. Okay. Now that the knee is filled with the saline solution, the next step is to make the two new incisions in the knee. Uh, we'll need the scalpel again? Okay, now we're being Jimmy Casket right here. Now we need to insert the atheroscope into the knee to see the, mis the meniscus. The arthroscope. Please insert the arthroscope. You can do that? The image from the arthroscope is blurry. Please adjust the focus by twisting the back of the instrument. Please focus. Okay. All right. We can now see where the uh, meniscus is torn inside. We need a couple of things. Okay, please pick up the hook scissors. Okay. Now please pick up the hook brass first. Let's move out the remaining meniscus. Please pick up the brass. Now run the brass from them. Okay. So I'm gonna smooth that out. Okay. And you can remove all the equipment. Okay, good. This is your needle. And we need thread. Okay. Almost done. These are the excessive strips. Okay. Now put these over here. Now 
please pick up the bandage. Okay. You've done a great job, Doctor. I'm sure Steve will recover in no time. Good. Alright, uh, let's see. Do we have time for one more? Uh, no. Uh, right now, I'm gonna leave this, uh, video right here. Right now, thank you all so much for watching. As always, be sure to be a awesome person by high five and that like button. I will see all of you awesome people in the next video.